and onward. I'm gonna shuffle some things around here. Wish I could go to that distress beacon, but I can't. Two Zoltan sectors. Thanks, game. Really appreciate that. This is cute. There's a little nebula in the middle. I can get some more jumps in this way. Not if they're all dead. Distress! I'm here to help! Unless you need missiles. Oh, we'll send my rock crew in. Hell yeah, man. Emergency respirators. Aye, that's nice. That's nice, especially with Zoltan. I mean, um, 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 Lenny is boarding. I like free augments. Nothing. Maybe I can go here. Eh. Maybe there's a store there. Maybe they have defense scramblers. Empty sector store! That that paid off, but then there's probably nothing here. Crew teleport back with battery repair drone. Nothing, nothing. Um, do I sell it? No, I'll keep it. Mm, do I buy missiles? That would be 36 scrap, though. Always a question. Mm, mm, painful, but yes. Get that bar of weapons. Now I can get two haul missiles and a Pegasus on if I just get the power. Notice this ship doesn't get a whole lot of power when you demand so much from your weapons all the time. And then again, I'm also trying to conserve two power for the defense drone system. So, there you go. Always need more power. I'm only pulling three shields, which is standard this far in the game, and I'm only pulling four engines, which is not standard, but he's got a heavy mark too, a heavy ion and an ion burst one. <laughs> That's six power for his weapons. His cloak's gonna be annoying. Because while the Pegasus with maximum weapon skill will fire before the cloaking hits, he might get his cloaking off before the missiles hit due to travel time. So you have to wait for him to cloak again, because Pegasus is just 20 second. Did it hit? It did, it did hit. Now I can throw a hull missile and an Artemis without missing. Holy crap, that was a level 3 cloaker. Pegasus fires once, I'll be fine. That's That'll be 4 damage, and he can't, he can't uh, dodge. One missile! I think I only burned one in that combat. I'm going to try and hit the nebula. Then again, I do kind of want to visit some extra beacons out here, but the nebula will slow him down two jumps for the price of one and but if I go up I can get a little more jumps around the exit then again that middle one doesn't connect to the, to the exit which is a strange setup it's going to stymie which ones I can use oh secure the ammunition the problem is, is when you get this option secure the fuel supply secure the ammunition you need to have a boarding crew because if you kill the ship it always says uh, there's not much left because you blew up the ship uh, if you board, you get the maximum reward out of this always. So if this is the type of encounter that benefits boarding ships, specifically more than any other encounter. Of course I'm going to take away that missile. I don't know what kind of missile it is. Hermes, Breach, we don't know. You hit my shields! Both of you go fix that. I'm going to need those back online. Looks like a Breach missile, but who knows. I have trouble discerning them because I don't use them often enough. He's got two shots, but we don't have a whole lot of power. I'm just trying to go for evasion there, taking off the um, defense drone. Me, let's see if I, he just fired the missile. Go defense, yes! I do not want that thing to hit me. A little bit of evasion for his, um, I was waiting for him to cloak before I fired the Pegasus. If it's 13 or 14 seconds, that's, that is a Hermes missile. Uh, three damage, yep, I guessed right. Because it took only 14 seconds for it to uh, come back online. The, the charge time is how you can tell. Hate him resisting that damage. Fucking rock plating. I had to sell mine to get my explosive replicator. I hope you're fucking happy. Game. God. 
There you go. I kind of want to breathe. Just, just saying. His weapon seems to be offline. He shuffled power, so he probably put it into the tele, the, the cloaking device, and it was locked. But now it's unlocked, and that weapon's charging again. So not only does he have his missile online, he's got his two shots online too. And I have no evasion right now. Okay, he's got three left. I need some evasion. I can probably turn that off, turn my shield on, get some double evasion. That's 30%. Oh, but his weapon's offline now, because he shuffled power again. But his cloaking's online, so I have to wait for another cycle. And he's going to get his evasion back. Or the whole missile could fire before he cloaks. Yeah! Sweet. Give me some oxygen. That three Hermes missile damage is annoying. That takes off two shields if it hits, man. Just like a breach bomb. Breach mark two. Breach one is not a weapon for sale anywhere. It's a weapon unique to a specific ship. It's not really worth having. It's inferior to breach two in every way. You'd think that it would be kind of superior in some ways to some other weapons. Like the Artemis that this ship starts with only one power. That's a superior Artemis to the one you can buy in the shops. Generally speaking, in missiles, each power bar represents a damage point. Ar Ar Artemis is usually two power and it's two damage. Leto was one power, one damage. Hermes is three power, three damage. All missile is two power, two damage, but four in systemless. And Pegasus is three power, two missiles. Two damage each. So the rule is semi consistent. If you factor in the Hall's iffy and the Pegasus iffy, it kind of averages out to one power per uh, energy bar. I'll participate in your study. You will give me some hard dough cakes and 20 scrap. I can probably get to this beacon before the distress. Asteroids. I don't sweat asteroids. Oh! Zoltan. A Zoltan and an asteroid. How quaint. I'll just wait till your shield goes down. You've got bombs though, that can seriously troll me. Watch it be an ion bomb and a small bomb. Because that's a serious troll combo right there. If you ion bomb and then small. You don't want to small bomb the shields after you ion them, but you small bomb like weapons and ion the shield. Okay, that is a small bomb. Two system damage. I kind of want to keep my defense drone online if I can help it just to help with some shield damage. It's a small and an ion. The small bomb fires pretty quick, but he'll run out of missiles really quick if he keeps bombing me like that. Uh, okay, his helm got hit, which is fine by me. Asteroids are not going to help me in this encounter. Four and two. Okay, so one Pegasus, one hull again. God, you hit the drones again. I was repairing that. You hit the helm. I have no dodge. I'm not a happy camper. But the ion didn't hit anything. Fine. That's fine. 21 missiles. That was a zero. Oh, you're screwed. I love all missiles for that purpose. One missile. Back to 21. Didn't I have 24 just a little bit ago? All three of you. Heal. I love how those two doors are still open. <laughs> and... Back to stations. I wish you could queue up one act with crew. Whatever act they're currently doing... Oh, I can hit the distress. And look, a store, but there's no way I have two jumps. One, two... Yeah. There's no way I have two jumps before the exit. I, I just don't. If I if I did, I'd hit the store and then back to that beacon, but you know. Two free missiles, three fuel, and 48 delicious scrap. Because the store would have been nice. It could have had a defense drone scrambler. Yeah, this isn't two. It's going to be just inside the bar, I can tell. A shield overcharger. You know, that would be fascinating if I could get that online. But the power consumption has me worried because the missiles are pretty hungry in power. Rock homeworlds, Zoltan homeworlds. Zoltan could give me a shield, Rock could give me rock plating. Provided you get lucky enough to find the right beacons and do the right quests. 
Hmm. I don't like Zoltan Shields, though. And I am Rocks. This is an interesting choice. I think I'll go... Can I upgrade? No, I'm, I'm saving for a shop. That's right. Um, Rock Home Worlds, probably. If I can get Rock Plating back on my ship, that would be great. Well, a lot of beacons seem to circle the exit, so maybe I'll get the quest. I'm just like, the quest could be further to the left. Oh, you could solve your problem by launching the missile in. Uh, give them five missiles? They could do a number of things for this. I'm using missiles. I'll give them five. Oh, that was useful. Might not have been worth five missiles, but ten hull points. I am in sector seven, they're going to repair me, but that's not the point. The point is, is that that actually was very useful. Considering all things. Worth the risk, I think. I love how I'm using missiles as barter, even though I'm going all missile route. Okay, where are you going to teleport? If it's going to be in one of those airlock doors, that would be fantastic. Uh, nope. There's a good chance, though, that I could fledge you out. Oh, shit, I should have kept those doors closed. I'm retarded. Yeah, I should have kept the doors closed because it would have delayed them. Oh, man. I was thinking something stupid, okay? It's alright. It's alright. I'm alright. He's got a burst 3, which is annoying, but a really interesting support weapon. He's trying to get to oxygen. He's not going to make it. I turned oxygen off. Rocks take a while to suffocate, but, you know, whatever. You can still do it. 35% evasion, and I couldn't dodge two of those five. Wow. And both of them hit. Uh, in engines, so dropped my evasion, so whatever. I mean, they didn't both hit engines, but they, one of them did. Knocked me down 10% evasion. 5%. Nope, 10%. Yeah. He's got cloaking, so that's going to be really difficult for my Pegasus to hit. See, that's what I'm talking about. Two misses. Come on. You can do that. There you go. Now don't resist the damage. Fuck! You fucking rock plating dicks! Miss. I see you getting into the shield room. Oxygen's still offline. My oxygen percentage is really low on the ship right now. I should turn it back online, but since that room I know has no oxygen, we'll be safe. Pegasus and Helm? Yeah. Mm, I want to do cloaking, because it's really annoying to wait out these cloaks, but... Oh, one of them missed, but he resisted damage. He didn't resist that. God, how many missiles am I wasting with his resist? This is the problem going to rock sectors with an all-missile run. Rock plating. You don't want them to resist your four damage. You want to try to avoid rock systems. You want to try to avoid Zoltan systems. You also want to try to avoid Angie systems because of their defense run unless you have the defense scrambler. So that's three systems you don't want. Um, I've got to say, don't resist that damage, you dick. One missile back. I'm down to 14. My god, that was painful. I felt every missile I fired. This few missiles, I'm not sure I have enough to take on the flagship. A couple stores and I buy like 10 missiles, that would be fine, but that would be like 80 scrap. I'm holding out my scrap for a store. I just want that defense scrambler. And again, I hope I get the quest here, because rock plating will seriously help me out. I mean, it doesn't kick in all the time. It's like a 15 or 20 percent, but maybe 15. Okay, intruders on board. I know for a fact you're going to destroy that system before the room floods, even with no oxygen. I think I'm prepared to stall for time. No, I'm not. I think I'll just take the hull damage. Oh, no, it didn't. For some reason, that vented... Oh, it's because my oxygen right now is less than 50%. If it was at 100%, he wouldn't have been able to defend. Okay, that's fine. But my oxygen was low enough to where it didn't matter. Hit the helm. Hit the empty room. Don't resist my damage. And there's a breach in that room, too. Sweet. I love hearing that sound. I actually suffocated the rocks out. 
didn't think I could. I mean, well, I knew I could. I didn't think it would happen that quickly, but oxygen was only in the 50s when we started, so we're good. He seriously can't hurt me with this weapon setup. Oh, if this, if I don't, if he doesn't resist. Yes, he's dead. Two missiles. I had 14 when I started. I'm up to 13. Not looking good. Sector 7, Rock Homeworlds, Rock Plating, and you need missiles for the flagship. And all the encounters before the flagship. It just be line the distress. Because if I get the quest, I want to have enough for the surface, invite him to join. It's Charlie! I would yell that louder, but I want to respect your guys' ears. It's Charlie! <laughs> Charlie! And he's a Zoltan. That extra power is going to come in handy. I'm telling you. Oh, here it is. Here's the quest. Oh, but it's over there. I mean, I, I don't really have enough jumps. There's like four jumps before the exit. I think I'll hit the distress instead. Uh, let's destroy the ship and loot it. It's a slug. They don't like that idea. Whatever. I didn't want to help. I didn't want to shield the ship with yours, and I don't have a repair drone. So you know what? Try to loot. Try to save missiles. I haven't run out of drones this run ever since I got the um, defense drone. Which, by the way, the defense drone is so worth the investment. You really should buy the drone system if it comes with a free defense drone. I've never seen the drone system come available with the shield drone, which would be interesting if it did, but it doesn't. Oh, that would have hit. I'm glad you shot that. He can't dodge. There you go. He's a slug ship. He's not going to have rock fighting, but he is going... Oh, you shot my defense drone! But your missile missed. Not the point. You shot my defense drone down. I gotta pop another one. I won't have it for this. Ugh, right in the med bay. Your Artemis just nuked me. You have slug repair gel, so the breaches don't matter much. Mmm! 66 scrap. And a firebomb. You know, that firebomb is looking really tempting to use. The trouble with the firebomb is the flagship has a lot of crew. And if your firebomb doesn't get lucky enough to, if you, like, bomb the shield room, right? If it doesn't get lucky enough to start four fires, they will get that under control well before it does any damage. Even with four fires, with four crew, they'll get it under control. The only thing about the firebomb is like, if you have a fire drone, ion weapons, and a firebomb, that would work really well because there's no way they could put out those fires. Combine that with cloaking, and you have a ship that doesn't need offensive weaponry to take down a ship. The fire alone will do it. Except the flagship, because if it kills the oxygen, the AI will take over. A store! I really want to hit that store, because it's, I'm in Sector 7. I'm not going to have another store chance, probably. There's not enough jumps to get that quest for rock plating, so I'm going to give up rock plating to go to that store. I think it's a smart thing to do. <clears throat> Only because of the probability. Actually, you're playing the probability either way. So, fuck it, I'm going to try. I'm going to ignore the store. Intruders on board. Oh. You know what would be great? Is if I had level 4 doors right now. As a matter of fact, <laughs> I can give myself level 4 doors and almost suffocate the rocks out. I like how the other rock is just all fine. Yeah, that shield room's dead. I mean, he's not going to destroy the shields before he has to run away. No. With two dudes on the door. They only do normal damage, though. Uh, oh, another store! I gave up that store to get a store. Okay. Infinite probability drive. Advanced steps on navigation. Oh, explosive replicator! Why can't it stack? I think I'll sell the firebomb. I mean, it really isn't doing me any good, and I don't have enough support for it to really make a difference. I don't have a crew teleporter to put rocks in to make the fire worth anything. And they're gonna put it out. I mean, it would stall some crew for some time, but I really think the damage is more important. I should sell the shield as well. There's no way I'm gonna get that shield drone online. It, it's an interesting concept if I could get it online. If I could get two of those online, it would be fantastic, but that would be six drone power. Mind control, cloaking, 
416 scrap. Don't you want weapons upgraded? Don't you want power upgraded? Yes, I do. And you're gonna need power for my control and cloaking. But oh my god, it's so tempting! Oh my god, it's so tempting! You know what? Good. I'm, I'm sorry for the cough. Flagship mind control will work so well. The missile will work well. Yes, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Oh. Oh, you're attacking my Zolt as I'm having a weird gasm here. Not only so much an orgasm, but a weird gasm. It's like, like I don't know what I want to do. And they offered me these two systems that require power. Like, you can power your defense drone, or you can power both these systems at level 1. Level 1 mind control is all you need. But look at my crew. I have four crew. There's no way that mind control wasn't a good option. I mean... It just wasn't. I'm selling that. I'm not going to use the Artemis again. I have seven power, and it's two hulls and a Pegasus, and I think that's what I need. Fuck the Artemis. I mean, I should probably heal Charlie. Just because he took a little bit of punishment with the suffocation and a couple of rocks, throwing some weird fist balls at them like they, they, they form them up at the hand and I could put him in mind control for permanent power but I think the shield charge is just slightly more valuable now I can't power the defense drone how's power looking you know I have five more reactor I mean power wouldn't be a problem if I had all that reactor upgraded Five more reactor would be fantastic. I could get the defense drone on, have three extra power, and have three more engines. Have seven engines. Oh, the quest. Not going to make it. I mean, there's probably enough jumps. Not really, because there's actually no beacon they can flee to. The rebels are too close. It won't happen. They would probably flee to one of those beacons up north. So, yeah, screw it. I mean, I'm at a store. I should just probably heal up. I mean, they're going to give me ten all points back but there's no guarantee I'll find a repair station and those those three extra points could matter so I'll just spend the rest of my scrap there what's your specialty door systems well my door systems is already in level three and I have no scrap 